Oh, Judah. Rest. Sleep. For a few hours of the night, let your mind be at peace. Peace. Love and peace. Do you think I don't long for them as much as you do? Where do you see them? You had heard this man from Nazareth. Blessed are the merciful, for they shall obtain mercy. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called the children of God. Children of God? That dead valley where we left them? I tell you, every man of Judea is unclean and will stay unclean until we've scoured off our bodies the trust and filth of being at the mercy of tyranny. No other life is possible except to wash this land clean. In blood? Yes, in blood. I know there is a law in life, but blood gets more blood as dog begets dog. Death generates death, as the vulture breeds the vulture. But the voice I heard today on the hill said, Love your enemy. Do good to those who despitefully use you. All who are born in this land hereafter can suffer as we have done. As you make us do now! Are we to bear nothing together? Even love? I can hardly draw breath without feeling you in my heart. But I know everything I do from this moment be as great a pain to you as you have ever suffered. It is better not to love me. It was Judah Ben-Hur I loved. What has become of him? You seem to be now the very thing you set out to destroy, giving evil for evil. Hatred is turning you to stone. It's as though you had become a Salah. Oh. 